Hello strange things and welcome to a very interesting edition of my YouTube series. Um, this is something new. I don't know how many times I'm going to be able to do it, but I thought it was something interesting to compare because these are the kind of things that I like to watch and it's something new. That's not just unboxings and reviews on my channel. Well, it is a kind of review. So, uh, for some of you that are coffee affiliates or like the uh, Fru Fru coffees as they call them, um, there's a whole big thing around Valentine's Day about the chocolate covered strawberry secret menu item drink. And if you don't know what that means, a secret menu item drink basically means that somebody has come up with a combination of the different flavors that Starbucks offers and they've put it together in a drink that tastes like something else, but it's not something you can order like you would order the white chocolate mocha or um, their green matcha tea. It's something that you have to tell them like how to make it. So there's recipes out there for like butterbeer. There's recipes for um, the Cinderella drink around the fall, which is white chocolate mocha and pumpkin. Um, and now there's this one that's supposed to taste like chocolate covered strawberries, which it's one of their cold brew coffees and you asked for it to have either mocha if you want it sweeter. I do, um, white chocolate mocha. So you get the vanilla sweet, sweet cream topped, um, <laughs> cold brew coffee with a pump of white chocolate mocha, a pump of raspberry. And then you ask to have the strawberry puree blended into the foam so that it's a pink topper. It is delicious. I am not going to lie. Um, I enjoyed it immensely when I went to go get it. Uh, I went with my coworker and we tried them out. Um, and it was very, very tasty. And when I went, um, I had to go buy Caribou. And I try to go to Caribou more often than Starbucks if possible. But they had on their menu, because I always get their malted mocha. But that seems to now, instead of being like a, just a summer drink, it's like an all-year drink. So they have a chocolate-covered strawberry drink. So I was like, well screw it. I'm going to try it and compare the difference because it really did like the cold brew one. Now that's very different because it's like an iced latte versus the cold brew drink. But you know, taste wise, and I haven't tried this yet. This is my first sip. I wanted to get my reaction what it tasted like to kind of compare and do like a quick little comparison review. Okay. So this one, as a more bold flavor, you taste more of the coffee in this one than you did in the Starbucks one. The difference, I think, the main big difference is this is definitely more strawberry tasting because the cold brew version, they ask you to put raspberry in it, which is delicious. But the raspberry that's in it does have a different taste than a strawberry would. So... I liked the raspberry and I thought it was quite good. But if you're looking for like more of the strawberry chocolate covered strawberry, strawberry chocolate covered strawberry, that's what they call them. Um, then I would go with caribou because this is definitely more strawberry tasting and definitely has a strawberry syrup in it. Watch it actually be um, raspberry. But it literally, it tastes more like strawberries to me than it does the raspberry. Raspberry to me has more of a, um, I'm trying to think. I, think, I feel like strawberry is more of a, I don't want to say pungent, but it's a stronger taste than raspberry is. Raspberry is more muted in my opinion. It blends with the coffee very nicely, but it, it tends to sit where it tastes, it, it you get like chocolate covered raspberry coffee. Like that's the coffee that I've had where you buy the grounds that way and like that's what it tastes like and that's what the Starbucks drink tastes like, but cold. Where the strawberry ones, like when you bite into a strawberry there is that burst of taste that is very distinct. And that's what this tastes like with the chocolate. Like this, the Starbucks drink I'll say is more like when you get them like frozen. When you get the frozen chocolate covered strawberries, that's what that tastes like. Um, this is more like if you made them fresh, like you just dip that strawberry into some hot chocolate and then ate it. Because of that, the stronger chocolate taste, the stronger strawberry taste, that's what this one tastes like. It's really hard to compare the two without the other one in front of me to like try them because I think what really seals it on the cold brew is the pink foam. The strawberry foam on it is very good and I do enjoy it a lot. I think that that adds a little something to it. So I don't know. You guys are going to have to try them and let me know. I think for the time being, I'm glad that Caribou has it as an option and I will definitely get it again. But um, <laughs> I don't know. I think I might have to go with Caribou on this one. Um, but if you guys have tried or if you've gone somewhere else, like I haven't seen if maybe Dunkin' Donuts has one to do like a true across the board test, I might do that one. But 
this is a Starbucks versus uh, Caribou Challenge. Maybe we'll have some more drinks that are like that in the future. Who knows? I'll check out some more secret menu items and see what they come up with. But I thought it was very interesting that Caribou kind of was like, you have a secret menu item, we have an actual menu item. So let's, let's do this thing. And it is very good. So if you haven't tried Caribou Coffee, 10 out of 10 do recommend. Um, I don't, I know that they have locations in a couple different places, but they're not an all over big brands such as Starbucks is on every street corner. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go back to my weekend and getting stuff done, but I just wanted to share that with you guys. I hope that you have a great one. And if you try these, please comment and let me know what you think. Or if you've tried another coffee house that has something similar, definitely let me know. Bye-bye.